Okay, so I guess we are live. Looks like I've checked that we can hear us. Hello, world. Uh, I don't know if there's anybody there. Street people. Hello, and the welcome three. to the stream. <laughs> It's three people, might very well be three of us though. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it is. I'm, well, I'm in chat, but that's about it. Okay, well, let's assume everything works uh, the way it should be working. Hello, everybody! Welcome back to uh, Pokemon Tabletop uh, uh, United, that's the one. I was gonna say Pokemon Tabletop Online, but that's the wrong. That, that's not even a thing. It's good Uh. Okay, well, <laughs> I guess uh, before we start, uh, like, I I've only got two messages this time. It's like amazing. Oh wow! We That's we did like well last first. time. Um, we well, first off, first off, isn't even one about the game itself. It's um, just saying that this time, uh, Andrew or or Fangle is live streaming rather than Rob, um, because last time it was kind of heavy on Rob's PC and or internet. Um, so we're trying this for change. Uh, again, the uh, video on demand will still be from um, my perspective because it will be recorded on my PC. And the second one is that apparently speed evasion can always be used instead of physical or special evasion. So I've been, um, well, basically stealth nerfing uh, Ekans and Pooch because uh, apparently uh... they are way better at dodging stuff than I thought they were. I thought. Okay, yeah. Okay, that makes it it kind of, of makes sense, but I figured, you know, there's one for uh, physical attacks, there's one for special attacks, and there's one for status uh, effects. I thought it made sense. Made sense. Well, it kind of does, but it, it was still cheating. So that is basically it um, in terms of uh, what announcements. Um, so let's jump into it. Well, last time on PTU, do you guys uh, remember what happened? And do not start at the end, start at like, I don't know, <laughs> the, <middle. laughs> the beginning of relevant stuff. Ah, oh, the beginning of the relevant stuff. Um... My mic broke. <laughs> oh yeah, it turns mic broke. Right, right, right at the new. start and everything was good. Uh, <laughs> then we... Oh god, what did we do? We hunted in the... Well, right now, we're, we're outside the shrine, and there's an Ordino and yeah. a Bulbasaur. No, 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 <laughs> he said start at the beginning! <laughs> uh, oh, I think he started sorry. off returning the... Uh, what was it? Poker crafting tools. kit. Poker crafting kit. Yeah. And, then you... and we got our reward, which was some balls, and... <laughs> We got balls. <laughs> it was just—it was just a load of balls. Like I have no idea what it was. No, it was, it was balls. Um. Then there was some Pidgeys. Yeah, a Pidgey, a Starly, and a Minchino. Uh, and two of them got a berry destroyed. And we turned them into a fine red mist. Yeah, except for the Pidgey, who got caught by Hi. Andrew, and Andrew actually nicknamed it by now. Uh, Andrew, would you care to tell? <laughs> <laughs> Do you still remember what you call it, or...? Oh yeah, Bob. <laughs> yes, it, it is Bob. called... Bob. No, I, Bob. I can't think of it. Actually, that so should... Ah, oh, it doesn't show the proper one, actually. Which is long for Kate. Uh... <laughs> yeah, so, uh, after that, we encountered... David slash Billy. David slash Billy. David yes. slash Billy. Um, it, there's, no, there's not a slash, that's his name. He is David slash okay. Billy. David, middle name slash, last name Billy. Yeah, his middle name is slash. Pretty beast name, actually. Pretty nice. slash. You know, yeah. pretty slash live in a Pokemon Billy, world. David slash Billy. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Yes. Uh, uh, you we met, met him. David. Uh, uh, he was hating and I hated him. And. He took us to the town. Yeah. Because we looked lost. Uh, along the <laughs> way, we saw some mysterious men in mysterious suits. Um, Cosplaying. Cosplayers, yeah, we saw a bunch of cosplayers. Uh, then we went to the town, where in the town we helped a fisherman who was terrible at fishing catch fish. Uh, <laughs> Martin got a stalker. 
Uh, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I, got, I got a frillish. Down got a frillish. And it's no longer called frillish, although it's showing up as frillish for some freaking reason. It's got a name. It's got, it's got, it's got a wonderful name. Um, but it's not, 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 the name's not showing up? Okay. Well, uh, I'll, I'll change it now. Um, right. Yeah. Darren got himself a frillish. Mark got himself a stalker. Um, uh, we threatened a bunch of kids. Made sexually inappropriate comments uh, about a girl whose tailor was stuck in a tree. Uh, I, I, I got up to, to eat a hot dog. Darren had a shower. <laughs> oh yeah, that was it. Yeah. We stole his rod and saved a Pichu <laughs> from uh, Ratatas. Yeah, that's right. Yes. Yeah. Um, uh, two Ratatas. What else happened? Oh yeah. Then we went back to school. Uh, and there's a tournament, and we're participating in the tournament, and we're going to train for the tournament. We found a shrine behind the, the tall grass that was full of Canadians. Um, <laughs> tall grass full of Canadians. Yeah. Yeah. Cause... Uh, and then we, yeah, the, then we found the shrine, and there was an Ordino and a Bulbasaur, and I wanted to catch the Bulbasaur, but it was just like I don't really want to start a fight with it. And yes. And then a helmet came out of the grass. I was just gonna say, and then as you walked away, you could hear a sharp noise and a thud, and you could see this. Helmet. It is. Uh, I made sprites. It is. It is good. Um, oh, you found medieval. It's Basuzo's helmet. Basuzo. He slayed ten men. What? It's a physics um, reference. Oh, I have no idea what you're talking about. Anyway, you uh, you found a helmet that uh, well suddenly appeared basically, and both the uh, Odno and the Bulbasaur were quite startled. Uh, you guys probably weren't uh, completely not caught by surprise, I guess. It's a way to say it. Um, I'm guessing the next thing he's going to say is roll initiative. <laughs> it's actually not, especially because rolling initiative is not a thing in this system. Um, but beside that, uh, no, you found the helmet, and you look around, and there's no one, there's nothing that you hadn't already seen, and uh, what did he do? <laughs> well, my guess is it's Martin Stalker's just throws a helmet. Uh, except the other one's all got uh, handed yeah, to rolls him uh, stealthily, and now it's... Now it's, uh, like, uh, obvious. Obvious, yeah. Um... I suppose there's not many stealthy ways to throw it. <laughs> no, true, but there wasn't a uh, a sharp oh, uh, noise before are the actual. Are we supposed to be on the map right now? Because I can't actually see. Uh, you should be able to see your party, right? Oh uh, yeah, no, okay, uh, it's yeah. I found I'll it. Say you need to find the shrine first, but <laughs> I was just really, really, really zoomed in. <laughs> so far, zoomed in, everything turned black. Yeah. Okay. Um. So it's on the ground, like. By our feet, is it? Uh, yeah. Um, it just uh, it basically fell down here and rolled down somewhere around here. I will pick it up. <gasps> fell you down from die. Rock flower. falls and you it... die. Sorry, what? <clears throat> it fell down from like here. Yeah, that's why uh, the sharp noise could be heard, and then it's the thud of it hitting the ground, and it rolled to. Uh, Oh, well, it rolled a bit closer. Okay, you pick up the helmet. Well, it feels heavy, it feels real, it, uh, it's uh, proper steel, It's it looks worn and um, Is there a head well kept at the same time. There's not a head in it, no. Why not? Yeah, we don't want it then. But it doesn't like one of those uh, phony helmets you see all the time, of course. Uh, but it looks like a, a proper, proper uh, helmet. Uh, does anybody have any sort of education that would be helpful? Because I know I don't. <laughs> I honestly can't remember what I'm educated in. Let's see, what would that be? I guess that would be general education. I, uh, actually, I'm not too bad. I don't think I have that. No. I, I, I have Absolutely not. I, oh, you... I have general education. Yes, I do. Yeah. 
You've got 3d6 plus 3. Well, actually, actually, has it, actually, I, oh, how much actually have guys, it. I have updated all of your character sheets. Is something I've got noticed. to notice. I've uh, updated all of your character sheets in the uh, roll 20 system to include all of your skills. Although there's not an automatic roll option for any of the added ones, I believe. But I'm not, not sure. The roll I roll? I'll watch our indications. Two. Probably make a stab and go. It's a helmet. Um, so Rob's rolled. Anybody else want to roll? If you want to roll, uh, you sure. can just uh, open your character sheet. Uh, look at what you There's should be rolling. It's the same value as mine. The 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 general education. Okay. Uh, what uh, what do I general? Okay, so so I have three in that. So what what's the no, roll? Well, if you open your character sheet on uh, roll twenty, uh, it will show you like the proper roll. Uh, so it's, it's in the it's skill general section. Education, two plus, whatever d6 plus whatever, but then you just type that into chat. Okay, so we've got an 11, we've got uh, an 8. Uh... Oh fuck, I did that wrong. <laughs> Mark did it wrong. There we go. Oh, it's actually only 1d6 plus 3 anyway, so... Um... <laughs> so you actually rolled better on your first one, <laughs> Mark. So I'm going to use that. Well, 11, 11, 8, and 8. Well, what you've learned, or what you guys learned by studying the thing, is that it is a uh, helmet, basically. A, a medieval helmet, uh, and it looks uh, real. No, you haven't really um, learned anything. You're not educated enough in this subject to know, like, from what period it I take offense. Be. But it's... Uh, it's not a kind of, it's, it's like a proper medieval helmet, so it's a couple of hundred years ago that people actually uh, wore them. And it looks, mm. does look like, like uh, it has been worn. How? So... How this worn? Uh, it's, got, it's got cuts and everything, and uh, dents. And does it look like it's well maintained, or is it... Yeah, somebody rusty. has... Uh, so it, it isn't rusty, it is still, well, it's not polished per se, but it's, uh, somebody's been taking care of it, for sure. Somebody uh, doesn't want their helmet to be uh, rotten. Call me crazy, but I'm going to turn to the Ordino and say, do you know what this crazy. is? Like, do you know where this comes from? Uh, well, crazy, the old man says. Uh, <laughs> get it? <laughs> uh, no, the other no. Uh, I'm gonna flip her because I like doing that. Advanced flip. Oh no! Oh no! I mean, it's not suddenly a male or no. Oh. Um, oh no! Uh, it looks at the helmet and uh, it, it studies it for a bit and it, it tries to fit its giant head in uh, to the helmet, which obviously Aww. doesn't work. And uh, oh, shit, freaking no, giant it, head! It seems to be uh, rather confused by it and it uh, hands it back. It, it obviously doesn't know what uh, it doesn't recognize it. Is. it. Okay, no. so it's not not the possession of some guardian of the shrine. Then. Yeah, no, doesn't recognize um. it. Bulbasaur so doesn't. Well, Bobso uh, seems to be rather uh, suspicious, but doesn't give up any sign that it knows what it is either. He, he's just generally suspicious. It's just his nature. In the meantime, uh, Zul still uh, feels a uh, growing feeling of uh, infatuation. That's just Andrew. It's fine. <laughs> Uh, the, grow it, the growing is him standing a little bit too close. Rubbing. Okay. Well, it's separate fantasy from reality. Yeah, again, dirty joke, actually. I'll just leave that. I'm not going to go there. <laughs> please, please don't. Okay, um. So, what's your next step, guys? Um. Can I put I my need... helmet on? Yeah, you can. Oh. It's, a, it's a bit big because it's it's not made for children. 
uh, apparently, or obviously. Put it um, on and approach that Bulbasaur, see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> if you put the helmet on and you see You go and get whipped, and that's like, what happens. have to guide you through a virtual yeah. dungeon. Uh, oh, nightmare. Actually, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm oh. just gonna put the helmet on and then go, let's go, oh. heroes, like really sarcastically. Oh, I wanna, I wanna watch Nightmare now. <laughs> Okay, so um, uh, you're wearing a helmet, uh, everything's fine and dandy, uh, your head doesn't explode, it's nothing weird. Um, okay, so you want to continue moving on then. Uh, what way are you guys going? It's still morning of the first day. Uh, in the afternoon, the roster for the tournament will be posted at the school. So uh, you've still got Howarth und Howarth. I guess the only real way to go is south, isn't it? Uh, yeah, or you could go into the uh, uh, well, vacuum the route or stuff. You're not, you're not doing anything about that Bulbasaur then, Rob. I, I, uh, it's not in my nature to disturb him. Like, he mm. is clearly like an installment in the environment rather than uh, a threat, so... Character-wise, I'm not that interested in it. Yeah. Okay. Well, somebody can start moving again then. My, my motivation is to tame things that are ferocious and wild. And there's than... there's no entrance to that shrine. It's sealed off, isn't it? Um, it's just uh. It's not, not an actual building or anything. It's, it's so. literally just the ruins of. It's just like pillars, there is yeah. comparatively little of it left. Yeah. Well, before we go, can we check this rubble? Um, yes, you can. Yeah. You find... Hold on tight. Rubble. Yes! Oh, gathering of rocks. <laughs> we can actually use those as improvised weapons. <laughs> yes, you can. Not sure you would want to, but you could. Good. Yeah. Then like again, I'm pretty sure really? like isn't. I'm pretty sure there are rules for just doing that anywhere, anyway. <laughs> yeah. It'd be like safari zone, wouldn't it? Well, actually, when you try and disturb the rubble, the other note comes running towards you, like, oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't, don't know. touch that. And it, it like takes the rubble from you and it puts it back exactly the way you found it. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> Meticulously placed. Oh, the really? Bulbasaur doesn't seem to be happy about it to die, does he? Bulbasaur! Whoa, 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 sorry. Bulbasaur doesn't seem to be, like, happy with anything. <laughs> no, that's it. true. Dude, I'm gonna go, if he starts anything again, I'm gonna go over there slap his shit. <laughs> I have an amalgam, not afraid to use it. Well, against the Bulbasaur, that would be very ineffective, but... It would be not very effective. <laughs> true. <laughs> I'll just hold it up and... I don't know do about that. Think? Amolga's got flying moves. I do have flying moves. It, I don't no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't have any flying moves. Me. Yeah, I oh, stole them. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Level 20, you get them. <laughs> okay. Jesus. Okay, I'll just throw... Uh, uh, we don't have any fire Pokemon. Okay, well... <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're leaving then. Alright, onwards! Onwards and upwards. Can I'm I wearing a helmet, I'm in charge. Well, actually, speaking of south, you were saying uh, that you might want to go south. Um, southward is more of a hilly, mountainy kind of uh, area with more caves and everything. So, uh, in terms of Mart looking for ground Pokemon, there's probably a better chance finding them there than there uh, is um, here in these forests. I might find an arrow. Tell you what, I'll see what's there. Uh, if there's anything decent, I'll keep monotyping. If there isn't, then I'm not fucking monotyping because I'm sort of. <laughs> You're like, so oh my god! Hard. I'm so disappointed that I. Uh, You're falling behind. Didn't catch slightly. that starlight. I wanted that starlight. <laughs> so yeah. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure you can see something there. We can. Something moving ahead in the bushes. Yes, in the uh, tall grass. Um, where you were moving through before, uh, but that was during the um, end of the day. This is the, uh, the the morning, and you can see some skiddo grazing in the grass. Uh, they seem to be quite content, um, not too God. fussed about you guys actually um, oh, moving oh, towards oh, them. Oh my God! I know what we need to do. Can I can I pet one? Can I just run up and pet one? 
Yeah, you could uh, you could put one. Should I uh, change you guys into uh, player character again? Uh, yep, can I, can I just run idea. up and put my hand on its little back? Because <laughs> that's what I want to do. <laughs> okay. I've got an idea. But I won't do it until everyone else has done their stuff. Okay, so you go yeah, over to pet the um, the skido, and it's like mostly ignoring you. It, it, it doesn't seem to react too much to touching it, and as you um, stroke it um, and touch its little tail, um, you can see uh, sort of um, the parts where you uh, pet it uh, sort of seem to grow or inflate rather as it uh, reaches out to your touch with its body. And that sounds very disturbing, way more disturbing than it should actually sound. Speak for yourself. <laughs> I'll only have to point out that it was his little tail. Like, yes. <laughs> yes. Gross. I'm gonna do the standard thing that Ariadne does when she meets new stuff, and she's gonna get the Pokedex out. Oh fuck. <laughs> I should really well, have that prepared, that part. You should really well, just just know well, that I'm going to poke everything with the Pokedex. I'm literally just going to go beep on everything that we find. Okay. I need a pen. I need a pen. I need a the dyslexics. <laughs> I mean, you Skiddo. can keep your amazing post it note art from last time. <laughs> I didn't. Disturbing. Skiddo, the Mount Pokemon. Uh, <laughs> if it has sunshine and water, it doesn't need to eat because it can generate energy from the leaves on its back. Can you, I, can, I can use the standing knife. <laughs> okay. So yeah, there's a number of them. Um, doesn't seem to be a particular leader or anything. It's just a flock of skitter. Um A herd. A herd. Uh, the flock of birds. Uh, yes. A parliament that's... of owls. <laughs> a grumble of pugs. What is it? Uh, that's a weird one. Anyway, where, 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 where are we on now? A standard so of monkeys. They're just reasons. happily like grazing or doing whatever. Yeah, they're just eating, not really paying attention to you guys. So I'm guessing that means there's no hostile Pokemon in the area because otherwise they would be slightly less. Uh, it's probably why they are out now in the morning instead of uh, during the afternoon or evening as they were before. Uh, Zul, um, could you do a perception check, please? Me? Yes. Sure. Perception is 1d6. Uh, I can't remember. Hang on. Yeah. Perception, 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 perception. Perception. Can't see it. Oh, wow! I, I rolled abysmally. Shall I uh, check for you? It's, uh, it's like in the ones that you can actually roll. The fifth oh, no, in your can't. skill list. It's two d six plus three. Right, I should remember that. Two d six. Two d six. Oh, eight. Okay, cause you um, you feel something. It's kind of like bumping into you. But you look down and you see it's 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 a bit of the rubble from the from the shrine. And as you quickly look around. Uh, you finally notice what it is, and it's a um, a little esper that's oh, it's so cute. <laughs> that I is um, offering you. Uh, uh, I was gonna say candy, but that's kind of not. It's offering you rocks. <laughs> Which can yeah. I have it, please? I please it have is, it. Is it male uh, or female? Wait, male or female? <laughs> this, is the, this is the deciding factor. Is it male You're or female? Going... You can. You're going to be able to tell from that distance. You say, okay. Um, well, it's it's quite. Uh, Have you got a penis? <laughs> if you're actually going to move towards it, it's uh, going to um, uh, move backwards again. I can't actually reach the freaking thing. Yes, now I can. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be frightened by Zul though. Uh, it seems to be quite uh, in lube or. I'll hold Isaac on his shoulder and just say, stop. Because <laughs> I can see it's moving stop away. in the name of love. Oh. I want it. Yeah, it's, it doesn't like it. It's mine. It's mine. 
And it seems uh, to be looking at you with like questioning eyes, wondering if you uh, if you appreciate the gift. Like uh, head cocked well, no, to one side. I'm gonna pretend that I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna go. Thanks, little buddy. You wanna come with us? Um, Let me seems... breathe them. She's uh, she's or he she. It it seems to be uh, looking at your um, fellow uh, adventurers, fellow trainers, and it's looking at them a, a bit uh, suspicious. But it, it's it hi it's hiding behind your legs basically, um, and that's. Uh... <laughs> don't worry, they don't mean any harm. I do. <laughs> he does, but the rest of them don't. Okay, it, well, it, it seems to, to trust you. It stays close to you, though. Uh, so. Can, Can I get it? To... Come fuck! Can I get it to follow me to the rest of the group? Um, you could try. You could try and charm it, maybe. Okay. Uh, I don't know what your charm is. I'm guessing not really high, but. Can yeah. we do Charm. anything Charm's to lower our one. threat and give hit and help him out? Well, you could try and charm as well. But... Wait a minute. Uh, my notch has an Oran berry. I wanna. I'll give the Esper the Oran berry. Try and befriend it with that. <laughs> notch. <laughs> this worked before. <laughs> give over notch. Give over. You need a friend. It's, uh, a... It makes... uh, takes the uh, the berry, and I'm gonna quickly cheat and see. What kind of diet Esper have? It's kind of making me oh, want to yes, play okay. Pokemon X and Y right now. <laughs> <laughs> I want an Esper. It uh, takes the uh, the berry and uh, it starts eating it very slowly. And uh, it seems to like uh, like the taste, so it keeps eating it. And uh, it it it, it, uh, it trusts you, so. It kind of moves towards the rest of the party, still staying close to you, and uh, you can see oh, it's got me. huge, daring eyes. It's, uh, <laughs> I love Aspers. It's, it's, it's a bit weird, actually. I'm gonna, I can actually show I'm you. I'm gonna guys try to group. be less threatening. I want to get that all forced to stare him in the eyes. I feel like you're coming okay. with me. It's in the. Uh, she's in the journal, or it's rather. Gotta know its, <laughs> gotta know its gender. Come back. Um, it's really important. Okay, you're gonna try and look less threatening. Yeah, yep. that's just a chance. That's it. Okay. Um. Well, come on, computer, work with me. Here. Come on, work with me. Um. Okay. John. Okay, well, it, it, it doesn't seem to be afraid of you anymore, and it uh, kind of seems to introduce itself to you, and makes a little bow. Hello. And you can and you can feel a certain uh, a nervous feeling as it's interacting with you. Well, uh, to satiate Isaac's uh, wants to know he wants to know what gender this is, so I better whip out the select the decks and find out. Um, this this Lexidex says, bless you. The Lexidex says, Lexidex sneezes. It says, Esper, the restraint Pokemon. It has enough psychic power to blast everything within 300 feet of itself, but it has no control over its power. So that's reassuring. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's like that guy from X. Uh, from, uh, what's his name? Cyclops? No, no, no. No, the other one. Like the one who explodes havoc. periodically. Havoc. Havoc does. I can't remember. Uh, anyway, so that's what this Lexidex says. It doesn't say anything about the gender. Okay. Well, I'm going to try and usher him onto my head. See if he'll come with us that way. Are you sure this is wise? <laughs> yeah, he trusts. He, she trusts me. Uh, sorry again. What are you, are you gonna? I want to usher the Esper onto my head. <laughs> you know, kind of like a piggyback. piggyback. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, you can do that. 
Oh, it actually looks like it's oh, it doing it. Like awesome. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess. You're That's pretty I mental. guess you're coming with us then, Esper. And the Esper seems quite pleased. And uh, you feel happiness as well. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Okay. I've got a team of more than one. <laughs> Um, cool. In the meantime, I'm going to take the helmet off because it's starting to become quite sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, in the meantime, there's still Skiddo everywhere. Uh, I don't know, um, they are moving around and they seem to have had enough to eat and are preparing to uh, Sorry about that. gather and leave. Well, it's fine. You're not going to get the uh, Esper. Uh, also, it's female. <gasps> Wait. <Perfect. laughs> eh. Eh. Uh, uh, it is a quiet Esper. Uh, uh, Do you, by a per perchance, have a nickname for it already? Uh, I don't, but I'll get back to you on that. Can I, can I, can I breed it? Because I can, because it's field type, and we have so many field types. <laughs> if, if you, <laughs> yes, you do. If you could. Because if we have both male and female, then, you know, it would be a pretty swag party going around. Right. <laughs> yeah, what, what are we going to do about these goats? I want to try and yes. milk one. <laughs> oh, you can! I've got a collection jar. He's got a collection jar. I can milk, I can milk one of these. Can I, can I, can I just, okay. like, can I, sit, <laughs> can I sit on top of one? <laughs> this uh, this yes, has suddenly you can become actually... goat simulator. You can actually ride uh, Skiddo. They are mountable. That's why there's the mount Pokemon. Okay. How 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 can I be all like, dude? Can I can I ride you and be all and not have it be weird? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you can. Not can I milk one weird. and not have it be mm. weird? I'm pretty sure um, it would take like a couple of years. Depends. If it's a man, then no. Uh, well, you can. It would just not be appropriate. It just wouldn't be milk. <laughs> Dude. Sorry. Too too disturbing. Sorry. Um Okay. Let me actually check. You could do a survival check to milk it. You'll first need to find a uh, a girl one of course. I would have to do an athletics check when I if I wanted to ride it. Oh oh survival. <laughs> oh yeah, you suck at athletics. Survival. Three D six plus one. Okay. I'll, I'll do that then. Is it the athletics actually? Have you checked? Huh? Have you checked uh, whether it's athletics? Oh no, no. I'm just I'm taking I'm taking a guess because it sounds like it would be. Uh, and plus, I don't have my I I forgot to get the sheets uh, the uh, rule book <laughs> again. You suck. 